Yes, guys, morning again. I'm mean, chasing the planet again. Yeah, holy pop breeze this morning. But we still have to work in the harbor. There's a big squall that goes down, you see there. And see one gone already there. Yeah, but we still have to work in the same way. And see what we can find. Probably used to this, is there? As you can see. Yes guys, a whole heap of breeze today. Yeah, it's a really good couple set. You don't see any great sign of the fish then, but it's better than sit down. Yeah, and just there I might eat some lunch. It's one of the settings of the boat here. Yeah. Right now this crate here. Yeah, some jacks and snapper. Macabac shad. All nation fish. Yeah, we call them weather fish. What is for all the other Rock bag now. Yeah. I see the rest of the igloo there. Yeah. So we're going on, we're getting there. Guys, yeah. Not a whole heap of fish, but this is wonderful. A great blessing. And the breeze is very strong. But we know a little corner, as usual. See how outside here stay. And you can look at the trees there to give you an idea what the breeze is. Very rough today. Yes. So as soon as we're going to go back out there now. Yeah, so I'm going to give you an idea what the breeze looks like. Yeah, we're coming out of this little place you now, our little shelter. Yeah, so we're going to give you an idea what the weather looks like out here now. Yeah, coming out of the shelter. Look like it's still 
Half a day of fishing come to an end. Yes, yeah, just a pick out in couple. I have a nice blue crab in my hand. Yeah, and we find a comfortable food, so we have to give thanks. Yes, guys, and we didn't go any anyway, and we didn't go anyway far. Yes, yeah, so it's a blessing. Yeah, we are going home. Yeah, home sweet home. Yeah, we're leaving that squall behind us. That's a massive squall there coming down with a lot of rain and breeze. That time we'll be home. Yeah, that is it, guys. Yeah, sun is still pretty high in the sky, but we didn't plan to stay all day. Yeah, so we are back near the shore again. Yes, guys. So I want to stay tuned. I want to see what we catch. Yeah, another day of blessing. Yeah. Yes, people. Yeah, just not telling me that. Yeah, yes, people. Just picking up the last fish. Day's done. Tired. Ready to go home. Yeah. Go and eat some food. Fry some fish. Yeah. You know what I mean? Relax. That is it. After a hard half a day's work. Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> half a day. Yeah, man. <laughs> Guys, stay tuned and see what we catch as we tell you when we reach in for the land. That is it. Yeah, that is it from Pearl Harbor again. Yeah, looking at the headquarters, them there. Yeah, I don't know how to go on this camera and family TV. That is HQ there, so I don't know how to go on this event. But guys, I saw it go. Yeah, as you say. We'll soon see what we catch. So river is going from the land now. Yeah. yeah. So yes guys, see the final catch here. Yeah. Two pound lobster. Probably two and a half pound. Judge me judging. I'm Sinapan Jack. Kingfish. Drumfish. Yeah, and some fryers underneath them. A wonderful catch guys. Yeah, see we have some more fries in you know that. There's a good catch in the afternoon. Yeah. yeah. So see Jason there guys. Yeah. Fish killer. That is it. Yeah, see him better now we take off him at. That is it guys. So I don't know we're going to do some of them fish in but you know stay tuned because anything can happen guys. So bless up on yourself. Until then. Just like that. Yes guys, good morning. I told you guys that you might see what we do with some of them fish here, man. Just to catch, yeah, and give you a little peek. So we have some of them clean up here, yeah. Snapper, jump fish, kingfish, macabac. There's a snook underneath there. Yes, guys, stay tuned and watch what going on with them fish here because them fish are lined up this morning with some boiled dumpling and yam. Yes, guys, they're dumpling on the fire already. Yeah, the dumpling on the fire there already. Yeah, pre-cooked. They're going to put in the savium in there. 
Yes, and just watch our go on. Me and Dream Island mistress there this morning. Yeah, everybody out, busy up and down. But we just have to give you an idea. <coughs> we just have to give you an idea what we do with some of the fish that we catch today. Right? So guys, you know, stay tuned and watch our go on. Yeah. Good morning guys. Welcome back to Dream Island TV. We're going to do some boiled dumpling this morning. It is on the stove cooking and some white yam and some brown stew fish. So stay tuned and look what I'll go on. Yeah, that is it guys. So see there? See, I peel the soft yam now. Yeah. It's not really soft yam, it's white yam, but if you put them on the dumpling in the same time, you're going to have a problem. If you want to cook with dumplings, you have to cut them too big, guys. So, yes. and we don't look when it junk up in the pot. So, she has pre cook the dumplings. Dumpling pre cook. Yeah. Then we put in a yam after. Yeah, that is it, guys. Yeah. Yeah. So, brother, dumplings are sort of turn on the stove so you can see them. Yeah, with a little cornmeal in them. Yes, guys. That is it. Turn up the stove so you can see the bubbling going on there now, guys. See there? Yeah. We're going to half cover him now because we can't make him boil over on the stove. Yeah, dumpling will frat up and boil over and nasty up the stove. Yeah, and block up the burner, them and thing like that. Yeah, so you half cover him like this and you watch how far the frat come up the same way and you can turn the stove down a little more just in case. Yeah, we're going to get our yam into the pot now to let it cook. So look, watch out. Yes, guys, this skill is just take time, put them in, you don't fling them, just them flash. Yeah, it's, you don't wait too long to burn up your hand either. Alright, so that is it, guys. Dumpling and white yam cooking together in the pot. Yeah, the yam, them gone underneath. You can see, guys, dumpling, them pre cooking up. Them start to float already. So the yam gone underneath there. So, you know, stay tuned and see when them finish cook. Yeah, just like that. Yeah, yeah guys, we're not going to cook all of this, you know, because we have a lot. So, we're going to take out some and season them. Because only me and Dream Island boss are here. Whitney's not here. Nobody else is here. So, we're going to take out some to get them seasoned. Yeah. yeah. That is it, guys. See there? I mean, I'm going to even go work on them, you know. So yeah. we're going to season this now. Yeah, brown soup, fish and dumpling. Boy, I'm telling you guys. So we just watch what I go on. And guys, this a breakfast, this you know guys. We got to be telling our notes, so we say good morning. This is a breakfast. So simple seasoning she had to do this morning guys. Yeah, just look. She have our mixture in the back of you know, and the black pepper and some other season. Yeah. Black pepper and fish season, right? Yeah. Uh, and uh, All purpose. Uh, all purpose, yeah. Yes, guys, so see there? Yeah, that is it now. Simple as that. You know, so she put some inside of the fish. Yeah. Yeah, that is it. As the season swap show. Yeah. Yes. Sprinkle over it and then you get some inside. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, guys, so as you know, this season is done, the fish now. Mm -hmm. So we're going to shake them up and let them get the mix from the property. Yeah, that yeah. is it. Yeah, stay tuned and watch the browning process. Yeah, that is it. So, guys, we're going to get the firelight now, turn the oil to add. If any water inside the pot, you have to let it dry out because the air will pop and burn you. So I'm going to wait till it dry out and put in the air. Yeah, so it's ready now, guys. And as you see, we have some skeleton here and some garlic. I love to burn them in the oil. That's it, give the, the fish a nice flavor. So stay tuned and watch out for that. Yeah, we're going to add a little piece of pepper in it because they have to put pepper in it too. Mm. So guys, we're going to get my um, skeleton in the pot now and the garlic. 
and the pepper. We let it burn in the oil a little bit and then we take them out back. Yes guys, so when them change colour, we go and take them out and then we add my fish in here. Because if them burn, they will be bitter. So we go and take them out now. Yeah, tell them. So guys, normally we don't wait long because them change now. So we go and take them out because if them burn too long, they will be bitter. So the oil at now, so we go and put in the fish now. Yes, guys, and snapper are going up. Yeah, and a drum fish. Gone in a hot tile, you know. Yeah. Yes, so, so all of them are going out fry, guys. So, guys, you're taking for my dumpling and my tarpium. Look what I'm going with them. Yes, so I get it as stir guys, so you know it before they stick to the pot if they don't stir it. Yeah, so that is it. Yeah, so guys, I'm ready to take out my fish them now, them finish brown. Yeah, yeah, the first set of fish that guy. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, if you drain off your oil then, because the pot is full of oil. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we're going to put in some more fish and brown. So we're going to put some more fish in the oil. We're going to fry. Yes, guys, so that is it. So, guys, may I prepare the season for the brown school fish? We have some thyme here, some scallion, tomato, sweet pepper, onion, hot pepper and garlic. Yeah, that's what we're going to cook for the brown stew fish. So I'm going to get my brown seeds and then properly wash guys. And then I'm going to wash properly and then dirty. So guys, we're ready to cook up the seeds and then for the, um, the brown stew fish. That is it guys, no cutting board. <laughs> All time style I do it. Yeah. That is it. Good old tomato. Like a Persic and Escalentum. <laughs> I first bet on the can learn that me learn the guy from then said the like of being good for you. Yeah. It stick for me more than all of the other one them. Yeah. That is it guy. Yeah. Yeah, the bell pepper that. Yeah. The sweet pepper. Sweet cutting guys, no crushing and no this, no that. Dream Island style. That is it. Yeah. The fish then finish um, brown now, so I'm going to get them on this stove now and get me seasoning them into it. This is my seasoning, guys. So I'm going to get them in the pot now. Then we're going to put some powder seasoning in it. Then 
And you notice know, that we have some butter in there too. Yeah, let it cook down in the fish. Yeah, we're going to put a little ketchup in there. I'm yeah, not going to throw too much ketchup in there because I have tomato in it already. So I'm going to add some water to it. Yeah, that is it guys. So stay tuned for the plating of the food. So guys, I turn up my dumpling pot. Yeah, and you notice the water gone down so it finished now. So I'm going straight off my dumpling pot. I can lock off the stove now. Yes guys, yeah, I just go eat my food and all you know. Mama Ivan eat already, maybe just have to taste it this man and run out. And Mama Ivan eat here one, she couldn't wait on me. So, guys, see what it look like, you know. You know. Yeah. I have two pieces of fried chicken there. You know what? Fried chicken, guys. See there? See my brown shoe fish there? With my yam and dumpling. Yeah. That is it, guys. Yeah, I go on the table, go eat my one and all. So, but we tell you now, it tastes not in me well, you know. Yeah, brown stew fish. Yeah. Guys, I'm not no nice like when you catch your own food, you know. Yeah. Especially meat can you catch when you hunt and catch and eat it, you know. It's nice. Yeah, so me and Jason catch them fish here, but Jason go on with some some more both him to himself. Yeah, why that you know we catch you and him together when the time comes, yeah. So that is it guys. Catching around the table. Thank you, Mummy Ivan. That is it. Yeah, just like that. So yes, guys, you yeah, reach on the table and I go eat my little one. You know. Yeah, I we'll tap it down with some ginger beer. Yeah, we call that ready make ginger beer in you know, artificial something. Yeah, but sometimes I work with it, guys. Yes, guys. Yeah, sit here in a brown shoe fish. I go work on you now. I go sample the food and I see what I go on and my even do with the fish. I move the chicken out of the way you know, because the chicken is just one little extra thing. You know. The fish are the real thing. Yeah, brown shoe fish. See the guy? Red snapper. Yes, guys. So, I'm going to bless the food as usual. You know. Yeah. Lord, we thank you for this food and we thank you for the hands that provide it, including everybody in the chain. From the farmers come right up. And I thank you for the health and strength to go out there and catch the fish with thank you my even, even the scraper for the fish. And God we ask that it be a benefit to my body after I consume it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So guys, I sample the fish and want to know it is. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yes guys, I'm always look forward to my even brown stew fish, you know, see them? Be a fish now. Taste with some Sweet pepper and tomato look wise, you know? Mm. Mm. Yes, guys, I tell me. Always nice. Always nice, yeah. You see the white ham here, guys. Yeah. Mm. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm. So, I work, go and work on my fish. Yeah. So, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And Dream Island TV will come into now again. We just put a little extra something show on one hour meal. You know. But catching in at the headquarters, man. I don't know our style already. I just too busy up and down. So guys, bless up on yourself. Until then. Just like that.